Here is a 12-year-old uh, uh, patient that came in to see me about um, about three months ago. He has a um, um, sensitivity on chewing and palpation on his anterior teeth. This is uh, tooth number seven. He has some radiolucency right at the apex. And uh, if you look, taking a look, a closer look at his X-ray, it has uh, what's called uh, dense invaginatus. It has a tooth within a tooth. And if you take actually a closer look, looks like um, maybe there's actually two two of them right here. So this uh, makes it a bit of an interesting uh, tooth to um, uh, deal with. We have to make sure all uh, this is cleaned out um, and make sure that. Uh, um, we get rid of the, all the bacteria and um, get him back in uh, uh, healing mode. So went ahead and uh, did a uh, working um, length picture, and uh, you can see the extent of that uh, radiolucency. It's very large, and this is the final uh, picture. So we're going to have him on a on your recall. You can see all that uh, dense imaginatus is pretty much uh, cleaned out. So it looks good. This is a um, another gentleman from a royal family of Asian Pacific uh, countries. He's a cousin to one of the presidents, so he was uh, very uh, highly referred to me and uh, saying that uh, he wants to keep his tooth. The general dentist calls me and says, you know, I um, do whatever you can to save this tooth. And uh, looking at the x-ray, it looks like uh, it's uh, pretty much fractured off due to deep decay under the crown. His uh, crown was still intact just from uh, all the gum tissue that was holding the crown in. So you could pretty much um, move the crown and pretty much pull it out. Um, so he was going to uh, need some help with this tooth. Uh, first of all, I uh, numbed him up and took, um, removed the crown and uh, looked like there was hardly anything left of the tooth uh, or the root left. And uh, so I called the general dentist and I said, you know, this is a very um, compromised case. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to save this. And he says, no, he's do whatever you can to save this tooth. So uh, we went ahead and uh, tried to save the tooth. We um, got um, the rubber dam on with the clamp and uh, did some gingivectomy around the tooth just to make sure that we can put the clamp on. Uh, got the working length and uh, did the root canal on the tooth here. It looks good. And um, uh, it looked like um, we were able to go ahead and uh, put a post on there with uh, built up. So then uh, he went back to the general dentist and got the crown on. And so he was very pleased with us as uh, far as uh, trying to hold on to this tooth. So this is uh, another uh, breakthrough as far as trying to save teeth as long as possible.